Pluto was one of the nine planets recognized to our solar system. But in 2006, it was relegated to the official status of dwarf planet by the International Astronomical Union, IEU. It will bring into clear focus once more what is, and what isn't, meant by the term planet. Researchers have found that divorce has different kinds of negative impacts on the planet, including higher demand for resources, and a lower rate of efficiency in the use of household resources. People have been talking about how to protect the environment and combat climate change, but divorce is an overlooked factor that needs to be considered. The elaborate and refined Japanese tea ceremony is meant to demonstrate respect through grace and good etiquette as demonstrated here by Jinshitsu Sen, 15th Grand Master of the Urusenk Tea School. When the young artist was asked about his drawing, he explained that he had started by taking a photograph of himself sitting by a window at home. He then drew his face from the photograph and replaced the buildings which were outside the window with trees. This gave the picture a softer, more artistic background.
Training to become an actor is an intensive process which requires curiosity, courage and commitment. You'll learn how to prepare for rehearsal, how to rehearse and how to use independent and proactive processes to achieve your best work possible for stage and screen. Public demand for education has remained strong, reflecting the importance of education as a means of social progress. Aware of the social value of education to the world of the work, the government continues to innovate and update the education system in order to produce a qualified and competent workforce. The preparation of abstract is an intellectual effort requiring general familiarity with the subject to bring out of the points of an author's argument course for skills and experience. Consequently, a considerable amount of qualified manpower that could be used to advantage in other ways must be diverted to the task of facilitating or to information. Tourism is a challenging sector on which divides statistics since businesses serving tourists also service local people. Therefore, it is not straightforward to estimate how much business sector's revenues and how many jobs are due to tourist expenditures.
Business school admissions officers said the new drive to attract younger students was in part the result of a realization that they had inadvertently limited their applicant pool by requiring several years' work experience. Talented students who might otherwise have gone to business school instead opted for a law or policy degree because they were intimidated by the expectation of work experience. When we recycle, used materials are converted into new products, reducing the need to consume natural resources. If used materials are not recycled, new products are made by extracting fresh, raw material from the earth, through mining and forestry. Recycling helps conserve important raw materials and protects natural habitats for the future. The teacher wants the children to feel confident about asking questions. The teacher wants the children to feel confident about asking questions. The school is widely admired for its excellent teaching quality. The school is widely admired for its excellent teaching quality. The charity has been involved in aid projects all around the world. The charity has been involved in aid projects all around the world. The doctor has been accused of violating professional ethics. The doctor has been accused of violating professional ethics. Geography is generally divided into two branches, human and physical. Geography is generally divided into two branches, human and physical. The government must try their best to reconstruct the shattered economy. The government must try their best to reconstruct the shattered economy. I will make this machine work even if I have to stay up all night. I will make this machine work even if I have to stay up all night. The woman went to a lawyer for some advice on her case. The woman went to a lawyer for some advice on her case. He has been advised by the doctor to increase his fiber intake. He has been advised by the doctor to increase his fiber intake. Historians use a wide range of primary and secondary sources for their research. Historians use a wide range of primary and secondary sources for their research. The red car came to a halt just in time to prevent an accident. The red car came to a halt just in time to prevent an accident.
The lamp on the roadside suddenly went out, leaving us in darkness. The lamp on the roadside suddenly went out, leaving us in darkness.
There is a lot of interesting. What forms these clouds? Why are these clouds there? Why do they sort of stick around? At the center, every cloud drop has a particle. You can't grow a cloud drop without having a particle there for the water to condense on. The key question that people not directly address until very recently is what actually forms these clouds. So for once you're looking at it over the ocean, turns out sea spray, sea salt is a very effective nucleus for forming clouds. So it's a really good chance that those are loaded with sea salt. But if you go inland, you start to have pollution come from all kinds of places, and so different sources form clouds more effectively than others, and we're trying to unravel which sources are actually contributing to the clouds. The clouds are incredibly important players in climate change, and that they reflect the white, they reflect the light back into space and so they're keeping things much, much cooler than they would be if they weren't there. They also play a huge role in regional weather, so in actuality, we're starting to see shifts where having more pollution input into the clouds is affecting weather patterns, in particular, is actually reducing the precipitation so we're starting to see drought in areas with super high levels of air pollution. You may remember that a few weeks ago we discussed the question of what photography is. Is it art, or is it a method of reproducing images? Do photographs belong in museums or just in our homes? Today I want to talk about a person who tried to make his professional life an answer to such questions. Alfred Stieglitz went from the United States to Germany to study engineering. While he was there, he became interested in photography and began to experiment with his camera. He took pictures under conditions that most photographers considered too difficult. He took them at night, in the rain, and of people and objects reflected in windows. When he returned to the United States he continued these revolutionary efforts. Stieglitz was the first person to photograph skyscrapers, clouds, and views from an airplane. What Stieglitz was trying to do in these photographs was what he tried to do throughout his life, make photography an art. He felt that photography could be just as good a form of self-expression as painting or drawing. For Stieglitz, his camera was his brush. While many photographers of the late 1800s and early 1900s thought of their work as a reproduction of identical images, Stieglitz saw his as a creative art form. He understood the power of the camera to capture the moment. In fact, he never retouched his prints or made copies of them. If he were in this classroom today, I'm sure he'd say, well, painters don't normally make extra copies of their paintings, do they? What do people wear on a rainy day? If someone asks you to give them a hand, what are they asking you to do? Which of these words can mean both color and fruit, red, orange, or purple? What does the capital letter P in road sign stand for? <laughs> 